Hello everyone, it's me again, Kinda Kill. Uh, it's my second video in English, so like the first one, be cool with my English, I'm just a French little dude. And you know the French is the worst English speaker in the world, you know that. So today I'm gonna show you how to export your client without using MCP tools, because MCP is very old and you can't export with new libraries like JSON from Google or Discord RCP, or if you're using Java 1.8, you can have some trouble using MCP. So in your Eclipse, you need to do a right click on your client, export java jar file and not readable jar file next you need to let the default option uh, on like export generated class file resources and compress the content of the jar file the other option need to be disabled and from the resource to export we're gonna just disable the version folder because all the file in the in this folder is for run the eclipse uh, java virtual machine with your new client so if you export that you don't need it because you don't run your uh, client with eclipse anymore but with a launcher so you need to disable version click finish after of course you select the export destinations we click finish you can have a few warnings but it's not a it's not critical so we're just gonna ignore it after that, you need to open your .dotra with Win Win WinRAR. I don't know you how you spell it. And you're gonna see your new code, your jars with all your libraries and other uh, files. You're gonna have a meta inf. You don't touch that. Uh, by default, you need to delete that. But in this case, with this method, we don't need to delete that and the Minecraft code. Uh, if you see, we don't have the asset resources with uh, PNG and uh, JSON. So you're gonna need to go on your MCP folder, JARS version 1.8 for my case. And we're gonna open the 1.8.8 for me. But if you use 1.12 or another version, you need to open that with WinRAR again. And we are just gonna copy, pass, drag your asset folder in your new client. Uh, why you take this asset from the MCP uh, folder? It's because it's gonna contain the new PNG or JSON you're gonna create. If you use the default 1.8 assets, you don't gonna have your new uh, stuff you create. And the final step for a working client is to copy past or drag the pack.png because if you start the client without this one, you're gonna have error with loading the default resource pack and sounds uh, system. So you just put the pack.png at the base of the of the folder, of the base of the dot .rar. And like that, you just need to push your uh, client in your uh, launcher system or whatever you, you give that to your players. And it's gonna run perfectly with your new libraries, uh, your new code, uh, etc. I hope I'll be clear with my English. Uh, if you have any trouble, don't hesitate to let the comments. I'm gonna respond to them uh, every time I can. So maybe with one or two days of delay. But I respond to every comment you let in this video. So uh, I hope it'll be useful for you. So I have nothing to, to tell you anymore. Just uh, pass in bonne journée. Au revoir.